IT leaders are experiencing a lot of challenges at the moment, especially when it comes to the amount of data that's growing in their industries. Digitalization is a very common term you hear nowadays with IT leaders, and every company that we speak to are looking to try and enhance their footprint, but they're trying to do it sustainably. So sustainability is a massive challenge. Data sovereignty is really important for countries and for companies who are working within those countries because there's laws now that are in place requiring companies to make sure any information, any personal information or data that's produced relating to their country is kept in that country and not, not exported or stored elsewhere where then that, that data is less secure. So there's a huge focus on that at the moment. And that's leading to a requirement for a lot of those companies to have a presence in the countries, in each of the countries that they're working in, that they operate within. And any data that's produced in those countries then has to be uh, stored there. So we are able to support those companies because we're present in all of the major metros in the world. We're able to guarantee that the data that they produce and store is stored in a particular location in an Equinix data center. Across all industries we've seen, a massive increase in data growth around artificial intelligence and all of that data that's being processed, data being made from other data, how do we ensure that what we're doing is sustainable from the beginning. So we're very focused on that. Equinix signed up to the Climate Neutral Data Centre Pact. We will be climate neutral by 2030 and we're taking a lot of steps to do that. We're working on what's called corporate power purchase agreements and we've signed up to a number of them around Europe already and around the world where we're helping additional renewable power to be built, uh, wind farms, solar farms to be built, which will then add more renewable power into the grids in which we operate. And that then will be available to everybody on that grid. One of the other major trends that we're seeing in the data center segment and the digital infrastructure segment is the expanding global footprint that co our customers need. And we're lucky that now we have customers located in Ireland, but they want to have a footprint in Brazil we can get them set up within a number of minutes to have a, a presence in Brazil where their customers can then experience the services that they offer as if they're there on the ground in Brazil. And that's the same for across the world. We also notice that the cancer research and, and, and the research that's going on around the world to, to uh, eliminate cancer is being shared on uh, Equinix networks. And people are able to now study and, and research all of these medical um, solutions uh, anywhere in the world uh, and they can share it with each other and constantly be interacting as if they're in the same room so that's very exciting. We're innovating in this space all the time and digitalization actually is going to lend itself and lead to a far more decarbonized and uh, sustainable uh, economy and environment within which we can work.